Good morning, everyone. Uh, this is uh, Thursday, January 11th, and this is the first uh, Board of Acquisition and Contract meeting for the new year 2018. Uh, I'm George Latimer, County Executive, and I will turn over the official opening at the beginning of the year session to our Secretary's Board of Acquisitions and Contract. Thank you. Good morning. Before we are commencing today's meeting, I know for the record that I have just gone to the reception area to invite any members of the public who wish to attend today's meeting to come to this conference room. And we do have one guest, Karen Sh from the League of Women Voters. Now I call this meeting of the Board of Acquisition and Contract to order. It is my understanding that a vote is required for chair of this board. I request that counsel to the board address this matter for the record. Okay. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Thank you. Tammy Altshuler, uh, Associate County Attorney. Section 161.01 of the County Charter sets the membership of this Board of Acquisition and Contract as follows. The County Executive, the Commissioner of Public Works and Transportation, and the Chairman of the County Board of Legislators. It does not specify who the Chair of the Board shall be. As such, a vote of the Chair by the members of the Board must take place. The Board has in the past taken such votes upon the beginning of the term of the County Executive. Any member may nominate himself or any other statutory member of the Board for the position of chair. Thank you, Council. Are there any nominations for the position of chair of the Board of Acquisition and Contract? Uh, I move the nomination of the County Executive, the Honorable George Latimer, as chair of the Board of Acquisition and Contract. I second that nomination. Are there any other nominations for chair of the Board? Now conduct the roll call vote for the chair of the Board of Acquisition and Contract. Mr. Kapicki? Yes. Mr. Boykin? Yes. Mr. Latimer? Yes. I note for the record that the County Executive, the Honorable George Latimer, has been elected as the chair of the Board of Acquisition and Contract. The chair will now conduct the rest of this meeting. Thank you. Thank you, Madam Secretary. Are there any other motions before we consider the agenda for today's meeting? Uh, Mr. Chairman, I move that we readopt the rules of, the, uh, of, of this Board of Acquisition and Contract. A copy of those rules has been circulated by the Secretary to the Board. Is there a second? I will second that. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Uh, the copy of the uh, rules, I assume, are available for anyone to uh, receive, if any member of the public or any other member uh, is interested in having a copy of those rules, we'll make them available so they can have them and follow them. I note the filing of the minutes for the last regular meeting uh, of 2017 and the receipt and filing of the secret review, which was prepared by the planning department for today's meeting. Now, we have an agenda for today's meeting, which uh, entitles 14 items, which is before us. And uh, it has been a while since I have been a member of the Board of Acquisitions and Contract, uh, only a, a, a quick 16 years. So uh, my understanding is that uh, unless there's any objection, uh, we move that the board consider agenda items 1 through 14. The floor is open for discussion of agenda items by any members of the board. Any of the 14 items? We got the answers. Okay. Then unless there's any objection, I move a vote on agenda items 1 through 14. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Any opposed? No. So it's unanimous. Uh, we understand uh, that there is an emergency man a manner that has arisen. It has come in a time frame that did not allow us to have an item before the board, but I'd ask uh, Commissioner uh, of Public Works, Acting Commissioner of Public Works, to uh, brief us on the topic. Yes. Uh, thank you. We have uh, an emergency uh, condition at the B1 level of the garage. There's been some spalling concrete uh, from one of the decks. Uh, the water basically gets between the concrete and the rebar, spalls, and it falls down. And uh, we have cautioned off the area. Uh, we have, through our emergency contract, uh, bringing in someone uh, that will set up netting, uh, caution off the area, and uh, and make sure that there's no additional uh, uh, any issues. That's a health and safety issue. Do we expect to see an emergency uh, uh, contract before us uh, next week here at ACC? Yes. Uh, yes, in accordance with uh, past county policy, I'm notifying the, the Board of ANC that there is an emergency situation requiring an emergency contract. I will be submitting a resolution next week seeking retroactive approval. Okay. Uh, 
And if there's any questions uh, by the Board of Legislators, the Chair of the Board of Legislators, yeah. or your staff, uh, please dialogue with us and we'll re uh, release whatever information yeah. is necessary. And the same would be true of any member of the public that wishes to know what, uh, what is happening and what the specifics are. Please feel free to reach out. If there are any questions on any of these issues that we uh, adopted as part of this sort of consent calendar, uh, please feel free to raise them in any other factor. Are there any other matters to be discussed? Unless there's any objection, I move to adjourn the meeting. The meeting is adjourned. Thank you. Thank you.